come for Zack. Spiffing fellow he is, but I'm not even sure you've met him. Colonel for Zackley Butterworth Toast. Bought no castle can meet with a ghost. Yes, yes. But someone or other forgot to declare to Colonel for Zack that the spectre was there. preview of what the DVDs for Travellers and Colonel Fazakli will look like. I hope you like them. Hello, uh, as well as the trailer bit that you've just seen, which I know is quite short, but it's quite a short thing, Colonel Fazakli anyway, so I thought I'd read you the original poem so that you could see uh, or imagine where we might go with it, so here we go. Colonel Fazakli Butterworth Toast bought an old castle complete with a ghost, but someone or other forgot to declare to Colonel Fazak that the spectre was there. On the very first evening while waiting to dine, the Colonel was taking a fine sherry wine, when the ghost with a furious flash and a flare shot out of the chimney and shivered, BEWARE! Colonel Fazakli put down his glass and said, My dear fellow, that's really first class. I just can't conceive how you do it at all. I imagine you're going to a fancy dress ball. At this the dread ghost gave a withering cry, said the colonel, his monocle firm in his eye. Now just how you do it, I wish I could think it. Do sit down and tell me, and please, have a drink. The ghost in his phosphorus cloak gave a roar and floated about between ceiling and floor. He walked through a wall and returned through a pane and backed up the chimney and came down again. Said the colonel, with laughter I'm feeling quite weak, as trickles of merriment ran down his cheek. My housewarming party, I hope you won't spurn. You must say you'll come and you'll give us a turn. At this, the poor spectre, quite out of his wits, proceeded to shake himself almost to bits. He rattled his chains, and he clattered his bones, and he filled the whole castle with mumbles and moans. But Colonel Fazakli, just as before, was simply delighted, and called out, ENCORE! At which the ghost vanished, his efforts in vain, and never was seen at the castle again. Oh dear, what a pity, said Colonel Fazak. I don't know his name, so I can't call him back. And then with a smile that was hard to define, Colonel Fazakli went in to dine. So I hope that's got you all excited about Colonel Fazakli. There will be a making of Colonel Fazakli at some point. There will also be a blooper reel of Colonel Fazakli slash um, Travellers. And also, next week, what you're going to see is what happened at the read-through, which hasn't happened for me yet, but will have by next week, if you see what I mean. On Monday, there's a read-through. On Thursday, you get a video seeing what happened at the read-through. You see how it all fits together. Magic. Goodbye.